What is goody goody to bop, my lovely, lovely people chatta? How we doing? I hope all is going well. It's your boy, King Devin there. You already know I look good. You might not, but I do. Just kidding. We all look good. I, today, am going to be doing a VOD review of, my name is Tim, but you already know we're going to be looking at some It's Timmy. And you already know, my favorite game, my favorite Battle Royale game is Apex. So we're going to be watching some Apex. I am thoroughly excited. And I hope you guys all are too. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, smash, smash those buttons. And don't forget to send a comment. Let me know if you like or enjoy the video. But without further ado, I hope you enjoy. All right, everybody. Peace. All right. All right. All right. All right. Here we go. Let's do it. Oh, boy. Oh, it looks like we're just going to watch this dude roll face one time. So, it's not really going to be very difficult for me to explain everything. I mean, you guys, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. He is very, very good at his gameplay. The dude is a monster. He knows exactly where to move. He knows exactly how to maneuver around the map. He's got the spatial awareness. He's got the, um, I mean, he's got everything. You know what I mean? He's got good aim, but also the placement and positioning. Dude's moving around like he's a monster. So it's just like when you're at this level of play, I mean, it, it's 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 pretty much you're just testing what you can and can't do. I mean, he's at a point where he doesn't have to question what he does in terms of like his, you know, how like as, as you're new playing the game, sometimes like you'll be like very, very introspective. You're inside your head. So you end up like you're stuck or you're conflicted. You're thinking about like what you're going to do, how you're moving, how you're doing what you're doing that this is second nature to him like he legitimately does this so much it's second nature to him he practices so much he does exactly what he needs to do so like he's the king of his thing if you will you know what i mean it's it's an honor to be i mean i wouldn't say necessarily an honor because like we're, we're we're peers but like it's definitely really cool to see somebody thriving and smashing a game like that like this Right there, uh, the one thing that I will say, one thing I will say about Timmy is he is not afraid to get right in your face and bombard you. Uh, and he's he's very very good at that. That's definitely something that I've picked up from watching him. Is just sometimes when in doubt, rush it out. Confidently though, don't be don't miss your shots. Like it's got to look like what you're about to see here. Yeah, if it looks like that, if it doesn't look like that and your shots aren't like that, I would not recommend you do that. I, killed an enemy. I mean, like, you could just see in his face the bull calm is all get out, bro. Look at him. Look, and again, he knows exactly what's going down. Oh. He's also not afraid to get shot. You're gonna get shot. It's a shooting game. You're gonna get shot. Don't don't get scared when you get shot. All right. So that right there, that was the wall bounce tap strafe to thick to, to thick picnic. The wall bounce tap strafe to thick picnic. You see the name over here, thick picnic. But but uh yeah. So the wall bounce tap strafe. That is a good mechanic to have there's two separate mechanics the wall bounce mechanic is very good i personally times i've bamboozled the heck out of people because i like to use mirage 
the tap strafe method is phenomenal. I use that so much because it's disgusting. You'll be in the middle of hitting somebody and it's just like zip. Wait, what? oh. <laughs> yeah, bro, it, it's it's nuts. It's nuts. It's it's a lot of fun. Here we go, here we go. Did they come, did they come back? Is that what that was? I think that's the same person that came back. What the fuck? That's what I'm saying, bro. Not really. I'm not gonna curse. In this game mode, I believe at a certain point, which they haven't hit yet in this, you get um you can come back. For those of you who don't know, in the solos mode, when you die once and it's early in the game, you get an opportunity to come back. And then they can kill you again because you can land in the same exact spot. It tells you in pinpoints on the map where exactly you died. At that point, you can fly back down and try and get your lick back. Or you can get killed twice and then be out of the game. That's, one, that's another thing that I think is very important that he does is... He pays attention, and he's always looking at not only whether his guns are loaded or not, which is important because a lot of people forget that, but also he makes sure that he's always at full health and full shields before he does any type of battle unless he gets caught out back to back to back. Ah, okay. That is extremely important right there. Matter of fact, let, let's uh I'm gonna go back a little bit. You'll see my face. Okay. We're gonna go back real quick because I wanna show you guys this right about here. Stop. Ready? Ready? Here is a big reason why he is so successful in the games that he plays. Did you just see that? Big, big thing. Ready? Something huge that I want you guys to pay attention to. He started missing his shots because he had himself off place. After that point, instead of him trying to consistently try to correct his aim while he's getting fried out because he's already hasn't been able to shoot them, and he's taken way more damage than he'd be able to give back in order to kill them because at that range and he wasn't even fully locked on them. What did he do? He dropped his target and he decided to recenter, refocus himself and get himself back into the game. That is a tactic that no one, you, not many people use, I see. And it always gets people killed. Do not tunnel vision on your target. Trust me, you'll get that lick back. Recenter, get your aim right, get your face right, then you can hit it. Whoever that is with that uh, flat line is 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 going crazy. Yeah, you're not gonna hit shots like that with a wingman. You're not that good. So you see how he missed every single shot. But even still, up close to the wingman, you devastated. Ooh. Giving my shields a recharge. Took out and recharging shields. I'm gonna edit out all of those ads because like thanks YouTube. Bull name Cream Lord, Doc. Stop with it. Uh, 
that real quick, real quick. That's a problem when you use Rampart. Just if you're gonna put your walls up, poise yourself to always be on the amplified side of the wall, or drop the wall. Like people don't think about stuff like this while they're fighting, and I'm just like, bro, are you not like pay attention? Pick the wall up. Put the wall down in front of you. That takes a shot. That one bullet will save your life. Same as before. Well, it doesn't work anymore because Mirage's decoy doesn't actually take the bullet. It goes through, so it's like a collapse. But like before, Mirage's decoy would take one bullet. That one bullet is important because that one bullet is your life or death. It really can be one HP. So like, pay attention when you play because this didn't have to happen. If they played it a little bit different, that didn't have to happen. And like, so then the worst part is, is the fact that like, they just got killed with their own technique. It's embarrassing. You know what I mean? Like you, it's embarrassing. You, you, you put that there and you gave him the extra damage to kill you. You gave him that as a rampart. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Dude's already at, what, 16 like kills? Kind of farming. You sure are, bro. Oh, my. Woo! Shot from the back. You hit them back shots, bro. You got hit with a back shot, they're chiefing. And he knows exactly how to air, but bro, I'm not going to lie. I spent a lesson with, like, 10 to 15 minutes Bullet just air burst in three, two, one. Right. See what I'm saying though? That's I do that. That's that's the important part. Like you gotta you gotta really know. Bro, you did not just try to peacekeeper him like that, bro. You don't. Bro, this bull. He run. First things first. He's running with a crazy loadout. He, like he's goaded for even just having that loadout and trying to do anything. Wingman PK, you're not Timmy, but okay. But I am. I'm a Tim. My name is Tim too, so like any any Tim plays like him. I don't know if you guys know that or not. But every single Tim, we all play like him. Oh, oh, he thought he had this work. My man's at what? 3,630 damage. He's got 19 kills. And there's still 13 players left. One more kill, he gets a 20 kill badge. I know it's like, you know, there goes 20. Number 20 right there. And then here we go with the 4K badge. Ready? Ready? But I mean, he's got this on every character and every level. Oh! Oh, Mr. Shreddy! Just like riding a motorcycle, always have two exit strategies. You need an extra strategy when you're getting shot at like that. Why am I being like hard focused right now? There goes 4,000. Look, look, 4,000 flat. Look, 20 kill badge, 4K badge right there, just like that. Still nine players left. What's up with it? And yeah. See, now that was a silly goose. Got hit with a headshot. Enemies are falling from the sky. Tough break, bro. Yeah, turbo havoc for sure. Absolutely. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, that's another thing. If you know that you've been to die like that, bro, I mean, you can't really fight it, but. Then they gave him a turbo to have it, because now the rest of this game is done. 
Like me with a Turbo Havoc. Him with a Turbo Havoc. I am taking fire. Oh, yeah. He knew he was a better player than that person is the only reason why that worked, but usually that would end up being like the banger. But even if you're going to make a mistake, you have to continuously be confident and understand that you know what you're doing when you're gameplay. Yeah. I didn't meet. Oh, he's got. He's got it too. You see how good. You see how useful it is to tap strafe? Because that technically did stop him from hitting them like that. That was. I, that part there, I don't know how he did that. Excuse me. That was the most beautiful. Alright, look. So look, 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 wait. <laughs> oh wait 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 we're gonna rewatch that practice your str that's another thing uh aim labs kovacs i have them both you either pay for kovacs or you get aim lab for free still i think i think it might still be free uh but but if not then you pay for either or when you get those either one of those games play them Practice your aim. You can't aim as good as you think you do. And even if you aim like him, he still plays Kovacs every single day. Why do you think he's goaded like this? The formula's right there. Practice and pay the heck attention. You guys act like, like, not you guys, like, not like my chat, but like, you, like, people act like bozos when they play this game. You can't just run in this game like, la -de -la -de -la, I want to kill people. Like, no, it's not going to work like that, bro. Use your brain. You want to perform? Well, I guess it depends on if you want to perform. I'm competitive. I like performing when I play these games. But I don't really want to be one of those, oh, I just want to see this life. The game looks great. That was like my first year of playing Apex. Not even first year. My first like less than a week. But like, you know, come on now. There goes the headshot. Three, two, one. He just knows he's that good. That's all yeah. that is. Dang, I snapped. Holy shit. Feel me? Well, I am gaming. And just like that, I mean, that's the recipe. You know what I mean? That is exactly the recipe right there. And that was his game. What did he end up with? I think he ended up with, uh, what was it? How many kills? 28 kills. He ended up with 28 kills. And 5,551 damage. I mean, come on now. And if it wasn't for the two assists, he'd have had 30 kills. You feel like like that. This is the formula. You really can learn from Timmy. Seriously. If you pay attention enough, you can learn from Timmy. It's not hard. Ready? Step one. I mean, well, you got to have regular fundamentals of the game. I'm not teaching you all that. You, you can learn that or I'll make another video for that. I'll make another video for that. I got it. Once you understand the fundamentals and you have your aim and you understand how to practice your aim so that way you're performing in your realm, your spatial awareness is extremely key. Or uh, they call it game sense here. Your aim, obviously, you can't miss your shot. Like, I know lots of people who can move like him. But when it comes to shooting the gun, it's like they forgot how to play, which would be great if the game wasn't a shooting game. It's a shooting game. You got to have your shots hit, too. Sorry, you just you just have to. But also, he consistently moves and knows when and when, when to engage 
And the most important part, way more important than knowing when to engage, knowing when to disengage. You saw that back there where he had that moment. He was completely off of his aim and just shot at the sky. Not the sky, but like he shot next to the person, anticipating their movement, but they didn't sway like that. Because of that, he didn't even take the time. He shot one, uh, I think it was like two bursts, and then he was like, all right, let me, let me recenter myself, and then I'll crush him. And you saw him do exactly that. These key elements are what will make or break you from this game. Straight like that. But at any rate, that was my first VOD review. From the one, the only, it's Timmy. Shout out to It's Timmy. Go ahead and follow him on socials. You already know where to find him because I'm sure you probably already follow him. Give him a shout out. Make sure you tell him that he's a good guy. Guy. And I will see you guys this week for another video. Till then, be happy, be healthy, look good. That's three right there. Happy, healthy, look good. Is never as good as your boy. Now, your boy is me, right? Right? That's me. Now, I hope all of you have a fantastic evening or day, wherever it's at. It's whatever o'clock somewhere. Peace.